you'll need something to write on. I've been using a uh, rosin paper, which you can get in a nice big roll from Home Depot for pretty cheap. Um, this is inspired by Brady Horan's number file uh, video series where he has mathematicians writing on some nice craft paper. This stuff is not quite so pretty, but it's pretty nice, or it's pretty good for this purpose. Um, I use a, I've been putting a little kitchen trash bag underneath it, just in case anything bleeds through. Um, I actually did try just putting this down and having it stay via static electricity and then writing on it with a dry erase marker, and that worked okay. But um, I tend to like move my hands around a lot and rest it on the thing and so it got all wrinkled and it was a little tricky. You'll need a stuff to write with um, and you'll need a tripod. This is an old one that I've had since forever, uh, so well before phones became cameras and you'll need a camera obviously. Um, so I lost the little guy that you mount the uh, camera on but it's easy to make out of a you know, a bolt or I uh, welded two together. You'll see why in a little bit. And then this important little guy, just a little mount from Amazon for your phone. Um, you just screw it on. It was cheap, very easy. And a lav mic. You probably don't necessarily need this if you're working inside, but it's absolutely essential if you're doing anything outside. Um, and if you, uh, you're doing anything outside, you need a little windscreen like that. Here's the setup. I've uh, spread out the paper, and um, I was using painter's tape or masking tape to tape down the paper, but I ran out of it and I've been too lazy to get more. So since I pick locks as a hobby, I have a lot of heavy things sitting around. And actually the students seem to like that, it seems to give it more visual interest. They can wonder what in the world is that? Um, and that keeps them paying a little bit more attention to actually what I'm trying to do on the piece of paper. Um, I put my notes up, it's hard to do here. I put my notes up there and obviously you should use a very dark colored paper and very dark writing so it's almost impossible to read what you want. And the phone is on the tripod and the reason why I made that extra long bolt to put it on is so that it sits a little bit more uh, vertically over the paper uh, which makes it look a little less weird uh, with the, the perspective. One other thing to note here, um, I use the, I've been using the, uh, the lav mic with the windscreen inside, um, not putting it on myself, but just putting it over there. Um, I don't think that's really necessary, although I've been getting over a cold, and so that actually seems to, using the windscreen seems to help cut down on uh, my recorded like breathing sounds, which is really annoying. Um, and also, just if, since it's sometimes a little hard to tell where the frame is, um, I'll mark uh, the edges of what everyone can see just really lightly uh, before I start so I don't start running off the page. A lesson learned, obviously, the hard way. 